So, now it's time to go off to Cabot's place, give him the package and find out what he wants. And hopefully what he wants is back at the mental institute because it's going to drive me nuts if we don't get to go in there. Oh, and I'm the type of guy who will never settle down Where pretty girls are, well, you know that I'm around And we're back. And we're still on our way to Jack Cabot's place where we're going to deliver a serum, a suspicious looking serum, to him. We took it from the corpse of a raider and we think it has something to do with the mental institute up in the northeast corner. However, whilst I was on my way to Jack Cabot's, I came across this green door that says boxing gym and uh, I pretty much thought to myself I absolutely have to go in there can we get up there so I, I absolutely have to go in there after I go somewhere else first okay this is a way to get onto the roofs and we want to get onto the roofs because we've no idea. What does this say? Maddens. All right. So this is Maddens Boxing Gym. This is possibly famous, isn't it? It's probably something that I should have heard of. Okay. And is it just going to be a collection of stuff for me to loot? As usual? Uh, toy rocket ship? Why bother with that? You open in a museum or something? Yeah, uh, maybe. Um, anything useful in here? Yes. Just stuff? You know, as, as I'm fond of saying, I, I don't mean to insult stuff or junk. Stuff and junk is, you know, nice. It's just... Okay. <laughs> Very funny. And it survived all these years without being nudged. Unless someone else has been in here in the meantime. Well, it does look like there's no other way in or out, so it is just a matter of um, looting everything. Fair enough. Already overloaded. She can't carry anymore. Oh, God, did I forget to take a lot of stuff off you when we left the castle? That's not great, is it? I tell you what, shall I... I'm carrying a no, it's that. I sold a lot of ammo. Did I just leave a lot of junk on you? I think I did. I tell you what, then. Let's set up a beacon for this. It does look like we've got rather a lot of... Oh, my God. Look at my carry weight. Now, I've actually been told that some of the later... Um, what, what would you call them? Perks in Strong Back could actually be useful. Do I want to use the cigarette machine or the cooler? The ice cooler looks like it would house this stuff better. That they have some hidden perks that would allow me to walk normally when overloaded and not take damage when overloaded, which could be extremely useful. But I'm saving up perks for heavy guns as well. Not that I ever use heavy guns, really. But, you know... I take them again for a laugh. Where? What? There it is. Salvage beacon. One of. And uh, we will send this to. I. Th it doesn't actually matter this time, but let's send it back to the castle. There you go. Oh. Oh God. Can I add this? Can I? I can. I can add it. Nice. Uh, what about the? Yeah. You know what? Let's. That, and that, and the Nuka Cola. I need to make some more Nuka Berry. Actually, I need Nuka 
cherry for that. But Nuka Power, Nuka Power is really useful for carry weight. But yeah, so maybe, maybe strong back is the way to go. I just kind of would like big guns. Not that that's really helpful at all. Because I'd have to take so little ammo with me to be able to actually still carry anything else. It's still a better idea to use other weapons. I think we've been in here. Have we, have we been in... Have we been in mean pastries? Have we... We're going shopping. Today... We, tonight, excuse me, it is night time. We shall... Be shopping. With a pussycat. Have I been in here? North End. I might have actually been in here. I might have. But if I was, I didn't loot all of the things that I now need. That does change. I've had different things on my uh, need list. For example, I don't need steel now. I've got plenty of it. I do need ceramic, I've, I've noticed. Really, I don't need asbestos. I find that really hard to believe, but all right, let's not. Dinner plates, steels, steel dinner plates, really? Oh, hello, pipe pistol, nah, not really worth it. Okay. So it's just an empty building with a cat in it. Can I pet the cat? Nope, I can't. Well, I'm going to take your ashtray and your coffee cups. I think I've been in there. I think I came through there after we met that serial killer person, if you remember. He was, um, interesting. Yes, I just jetpacked over something I could have walked out of. Right, where was Cabot? I remember his place was pretty heavily guarded. Those guys are not showing up as hostile at the moment. I'm pretty sure it's behind me. That's Bunker Hill. I do actually have someone. Oh, I got something up there. I'm pretty sure I have some people to uh, to kill there. Oh, I'm right next to Jack Cabot's house. Private property, no trespassing. Here we go. There was a sentry okay. box. What the hell is a building that noise doing in a rundown city like this? That, my dear, is a good question. And I'm hoping that we will get a better idea of that as and Acceptable. when. Imogene is missing and I want her found. She's not missing, mother. Do you know where she is? No, but that doesn't Your sister mean... is missing and I want her found. What else is Edward for if not to keep the family safe? I'd be happy to send someone to look for her, ma'am. It's not... Mother, a... Edward has better things to do than sending someone out to find Imogene. Again. I'll do it. If your father were here, he'd send someone to find Imogene. I'm not going to have Edward drop everything just because Imogene decided to take a lover mm. again. Jack, how dare you speak so disrespectfully about your sister? Okay. So did you find out what happened I to the courier? You don't care what oh, to your that's sister. the courier I found. That's went. the she courier. Yeah. When do I get paid? Hardly worth my time. Just a few raid. Some raiders set up camp near me. Parsons She's and ambushed him. Woman. Some raiders set up camp near Parsons and ambushed him. I took care of them. Hmm. I don't like raiders operating so close to Parsons. I hope this isn't the start of something serious. What about the serum he was carrying? Did you get any of it back? Right now. I didn't find any. I guess they must have used it all. Oh. Do. What's so important about this serum? You're getting paid to follow orders. Your orders were to get it back. That's all you need to worry about. I'm. Why am I getting this little. Thing that's like do, 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 lie, but I've got no real reason to lie other than that little feeling. I didn't find, apart from the fact that it was a suspicious looking serum, I didn't find any. I guess they must have used it all. Tick tock. 
Maybe no, 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 okay, no, give him the serum. There was only this one vial left. Oh, good. I was afraid we wouldn't get any of it back. Here's your pay for the job. I'm throwing in a little bonus for bringing back the serum. That was good work. Now, as far as what's next... Oh, hell, I guess it's time you met Wilhelmina. Jack's not gonna be happy about it. Come on. Imogene? Someone to find Imogene. I'm not Imogene's babe. Jack. I'll take care of it. Mrs. Cabot, don't worry. I'll send someone to find Imogene. There might Thank be some you. valuable stuff inside. I can always count on Let's you. Let's go check it out. Why can't you be as devoted as dear Edward? <sighs> you shouldn't indulge her, Edward. It just makes her more impossible to deal with next time. Just doing my job. Speaking of which, here's all we got back of the last delivery from Parsons. Raiders got the rest of it, I'm sorry to say. Ah, oh, good. Finally. This will help settle Mother down. Emma Jean is Jack's sister. You probably figured that out yourself. Oh, She's, uh, yeah. a little flighty. Impulsive. From time to time, she runs off. Usually with a new boyfriend. Then I send somebody to bring her home. Okay, I'll bring her back, I guess. Sarcastic, great. The sister's even crazier than Jack. Do you know where she's gone? Do you know where she's gone? No. But it shouldn't be too hard to find out. She's been spending a lot of time in Good Neighbor. That's a jazz club there. The third rail. Somebody there must know something. She's not known for keeping her mouth shut. Okay. And if she doesn't want to come home, I know the third rail. I'll ask her around there. But, but out of curiosity, what happens? What if she doesn't want to come home? Obviously, as one of the family, you can't just knock her in the head and drag her home by her heels. Usually, by the time I send someone after her, she's gotten bored with the whole thing and is ready to come home. I'm sure you'll think of something. You're supposed to be resourceful, remember? Yeah, I... All right. So, we've basically got optional. Ask around the third rail about Imogen. Find Imogen Cabot, and to do this, we've got to go to Good Neighbor. We could skip that stage and go straight to finding our ourselves, but I suspect we're not going to do a very good job of that. You're not sending me back to the mental hospital place, are you? That's a little aggravating. Let's have a look. What have I got on my... Talk to Ellie, that's in... And meet Ness at the crash site. Oh! Yeah! Promised I'd meet someone there a long time ago. They can't still be there. I'm going to take those two off my list so that I have a clearer map. And know that I'm going in this direction. Let's go to Good Neighbor. We are going in the opposite direction to the one I originally envisaged. That being back up north. We've still got the Saga's Ironworks to visit and fix. That That's not... That is a cool. Have you not met them before? Oh god. You gotta do this more often. Uh, really, we are going to be doing this so very often, you will re regret saying that. Yes, you will. Power armor or no power armor. Okay, are we in enemy territory here? We might be. Good neighbor is over. What's this? Old corner books. Oh, God! Oh, I remember this place. Oh, God. Probably. Did you hear that? Something's ghosting us. It's a wild. Mongrel? Okay. That sounded a lot bigger. 
Yes, it did. No, we've we've been in here. The old corner bookstore. Yes, we have. Good neighbor is right over there, apparently. Old corner bookstore, mass fusion building. Yeah, no, it is. Actually, I think I was looking right at it, wasn't it? You'll. I was going to say you'll like good neighbor, but I have a feeling you've probably been there before. I can't imagine you've never been there before. I mean, you, you got out of the combat zone occasionally, right? Of course you did. Now, I did have some other things to do here, I think. Silver Shroud stuff. Oh, no. The Silver Shroud stuff was those two people I'm supposed to be killing for, um, what's his name? Wow. This place is a shite hole. And here I thought it couldn't get any worse than the combat zone. It's not that bad, to be honest. I mean, it's a bit rough, I'll give you that. The mayor's a bit of a hard case, but seems reasonably fair and, you know, reasonably decent, to be honest. It's safe-ish. I'd, I'd rather live here than in the, um... Charlie serves the drinks. I deal with the drunk. That's nice to know. Yeah, don't talk to Charlie. Charlie is the, um, barman. And he's a bit of a nutter. He has some very shady jobs. And there's a guy called McCready in here. Who, for some odd reason, always strikes me as wearing the wrong outfit. I don't know what it is. Right. So, we need to ask around the third rail about Imogene. We could talk to the uh, singer. Peace, brother. Peace. Yeah. Got hips. Can oh. you step through the gate? You got balls. Drifter. For love. I shouldn't I interrupt her when she's singing. Let's talk. Ah, so, Who's you're man back. In Jinx and my pleasant company is still available. Uh, do you know Imogen Cabot? Yeah. Do you know Imogen Cabot? Name rings a bell. Kind of balmy. Haven't seen her in a while, though. Try Magnolia. She likes to right. make friends with people. She might know more about this missing bird. Magnolia! This guy wants a word! Don't int Okay, I was gonna say don't interrupt her with the she was singing, dude. Hi again! How are you doing? Magnolia. Hello again. Something I can do for you? Uh flirt. Ooh! Ah! Just been flirting with the... No. Let's go right to... Do you know Imogene Cabot? Imogene? Yeah. Sure. I know her. I haven't seen her in a while, though. Are you a friend of hers? Uh, she's missing and her family's worried about her. Let's go straight. She's missing and her family's worried about her. <laughs> I'm glad somebody's looking out for her. She seems like a body that could use looking after. Oh... Okay, um... Please, tell me what you know. There was this preacher fellow who used to come in here all the time. One of the slick ones. Always going on about remaking your life and so on. Most of the customers wouldn't give him the time of day, but Emma Jane, she latched on to him for some reason. I don't suppose it hurt that he was easy on the eyes. Mmm, intense. Some women find that irresistible. Pam! Would you come over here a minute? Who? Who's Ham? Is there a problem, Miss Magnolia? No, this fine gentleman here was just looking for Imogene. Do you happen to know where that preacher fella came from? Hmm, Brother Thomas? Yes, that's right. The one Imogene was always hanging on. Had to throw him out. Wouldn't stop bothering customers with that salvation racket. Kept going on and on about joining him at the back bay. Then he'd shove those stupid flyers in your face. Here, I kept one of them, just in case he didn't pay his bar tab. Mm. Well, thanks, honey. You were a big help. Anything for you, miss. I hope Evan Jean's all right. I didn't much like the idea of her going off with that preacher fella. You again. It's my lucky day. What do you need? Um, I'm... I'm... Nothing. Yeah. I'll leave you to it. I'm Stop gonna... by any time. 
I will. I'm going to get out of here before I get in trouble and start yeah. a fight between a singer and a psychopath in pink power armor. Oh, this is not good. No, it's not good at all. Imogene Cabot seems to be at the Charles View Amphitheatre. And I'm not sure if you guys remember that place. It was where there was a bunch of religious people trying to get me to give up all of my earthly possessions. And when I said, no, thank you, they decided to try and shoot me and I wiped them out. I'm hoping she was not amongst them. And here's the thing, unless it's... My first thought was, do they need my help? And then my next thought was, no, they might have just been finishing a moment of, um, you know. So maybe they would resent my help. I mean, I think what I'm getting at is they're either having sex or they both just died. In which case, I don't believe I am required. My services are somewhat redundant. Easiest way to do this without getting viciously killed. Follow your provisioner. <laughs> My provisioners are total badasses. Right, we'll go along here and then follow the road. He says immediately, abandoning. Leave that junk behind. We're just wasting space. No, I'm not. Maybe I am. I, it's difficult to tell. It really is. You never know what you're going to need. Okay, this, this was another way of getting to the same place, I guess. Yeah, it, it, it's right here. This could be very bad. If I've killed this woman, what do I tell him? Huh. I'm tired from lack of sleep. Was it up there we heard? Huh? Let's just get the high ground and make sure we have it. Before we... Oh, there's a stairway there. Tell you what, let's just do this. Oh, I saw someone. That's a raider. That's a monkey. Um, an ape, actually. I do not believe that was a monkey. Actually, again, we've had this conversation before, haven't we? I think technically they're still as a missionary. These are the people I killed. Yeah. Okay, let's um. Our eyes open for s person could be locked in there. Well, here's something you don't come across every day. There isn't a speck of dirt anywhere. I, I can see a few specks of dirt. Oh, brother Thomas. Hi. Excuse me. Welcome, neighbor. We're always glad to see a new face around here. Step right this way and I'll be happy to tell you all about our movement and how you can be a part of it. The, the last guy who gave me this sales pitch ended up dead. Um, that is very, very true, dude. I'm looking for Imogene Cabot. Oh, I'm sorry, but Imogene is indisposed right now. She's not seeing visitors. She's going to see me. Uh, her family's worried about her. You can tell them that she's fine. No. Not I'm... that it's any of your business, but she and I are just having a little relationship trouble. Mm. You know how it is. Mm. She's not seeing anybody until she cools off. Ah, uh, I'm a friend of the family. Maybe I can talk some sense into her. I killed the last guy who was running this scam in case that matters to you. Um... Yeah, uh, maybe that's the best way I to killed the last this. guy who was running this scam, in case that matters to you. We could always start by ripping your damn arms off. Uh, good, <laughs> good to know. 
Let me just unlock the door for you, okay? Thank you. I mean, ordinarily I would have tried to be nice, but the whole I'm with the family thing wasn't working, and frankly, let's face it, he was going to try and con me out of everything I own again. I can't believe you didn't bother clearing up the last people who tried this. Initiate. With a chef's hat. Where's the main boss guy? I can't believe all of this is considered stealing. Well, I guess it's his now. I suppose. Finders keepers. She's all yours, neighbor. Thank you very much. Okay, she's not tied to the bed. Hi. You must be Imogene. Don't tell me. Jack sent you. Okay, then I won't. You're Jack's sister. I was expecting someone a bit younger. <gasps> that sounds rude. But let's do it anyway. You're Jack's sister. I was expecting someone a bit younger. You really know how to flatter a lady, don't you? I know. I, that Just was to rude. Be clear, but I'm Jack's younger sister. The this baby serum's of the keeping family. them alive, isn't Once it? Once I get home and get some of Jack's serum, I'll be back to my usual stunning self. Right. Yeah. Jack has a serum that reverses aging. It's more like it halts aging. I started taking it when I was 32, so normally that's what I look like. You'll see once I get my treatment. I was well known as one of the bells of Boston society, back when there was any. What happens if you don't get more serum? There's only one vial of serum, Raider's got the rest. Actually, there's only one vial of the serum left. Raider's got the rest. I'd better get home before Mother convinces Jack that she needs all of it. That he could still be such a mama's boy at his age is ridiculous. How old is I'm he? I'm so disappointed in Thomas. He seemed so interesting at first. But after we came here, he turned out to be just another brute. He actually thought it could force me to join his absurd cult. Need anything before you go? Your boyfriend, Thomas, was a real charmer. I hope you don't need to say goodbye to your boyfriend. Do you need anything before we need get anything out of here? before we go? No. I didn't bring anything worth taking with me. Oh, I'm not going with you. You can tell Mother I'll be along home before too long. I just need a drink first. Um, all right, I guess, I suppose. Is it still considered? Oh, no. I'm doing it for their own good. Those people do not need bullets. Actually, that's that's a lie. I'm doing it for my good. I don't need these people to have bullets. They probably need bullets because they're probably not going to do very well without them. I find myself having a hard time feeling sorry for the preacher, though. Yes, indeed. Kate, are you... Yeah, there you are. Unfortunately, I'm a little tired, apparently. I need sleep. In the last two days, I've only had one night's sleep. That's the main problem. My, my sleep cycle's completely messed up, basically. Traveling a lot at night is probably a bad hey idea. Damn, the signal is strangely weak. There might be some valuable stuff inside. Let's Edward, go check it out. over to the Hartley modulator. Do you copy? Gee, now. How's this? Oh, 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 that's done it. Edward, what's going on there? We're under attack. They're inside the building. Inside? Can you keep them out of the basement? I'm trying, Jack. I I've never seen raiders that... Okay, tell me where they are now. Come on, quickly. For God's sake, Sammy. The doorway, right there. Tell me where they are. Sorry. Things are a little busy around here right now. Listen, if they're inside the building, you have to go to the office and shut down the elevator. You can't risk them getting to Lorenzo. Got it. Office. Elevator. You better round up whoever you can and get them. That's me. I'm whoever you can. Hello? Round me up. Edward? Come in. Edward! Ah. There's no signal at all. I've lost him. What's happening, Jack? If these people are inside Parsons, if they free him... Don't worry, I'll handle Free him? him? I always knew it would end this way. I never should have allowed you to lock up Lorenzo in that place. That Who's Lorenzo? Helping mother. And as I recall, using the serum was your idea, not mine. 
So what are you going to do? I said I'll handle it. I'm thinking. Yoo-hoo! Oh, What's you want going me? on? Oh. That was Edward. He's at Parsons, the old asylum. They're under attack by raiders. It's strange. The guards have held off raiders before without any trouble. I don't know what's gone wrong this time. They may have been a bit uh, undermanned because somebody shot some of them, maybe. I found Imogen. She's fine. Do you not care? I found Imogen. She's fine. Imogen. Oh, yes. Good. Thank you. At least one small comfort on this terrible day. You'll be wanting to be paid, of course. Edward usually handles these things. Caps is what you use for currency, isn't that right? Here. I hope that's the right amount. Now, we really need to focus on the current emergency. How right. can you be so callous about your sister's safety? I wonder if these could be the same raiders that stole that last shipment. If some of them had used the undiluted serum, it could explain their unusual success against Edward's men. What exactly does the serum do? What exactly does this serum do? I suppose it's time you knew. The main benefit of the serum is to halt aging. My family and I are all over 400 years old. But it also Wait. confers other... What? Especially in the undiluted form that the raiders stole. It increases strength and resistance to all kinds of physical damage. So at least some of these raiders may be much more dangerous than the ones you're used to dealing with. Four hundred? You were born before the Great War. Where do you get this serum from? Wait, just... If you're four hundred years old, then you were born before the Great War. Yes, I think you were too. I'd say mid-21st century. How in the hell do you know that? What makes you think that? Um, patterns of speech, general demeanor, physical health. You reminded me of the old days the moment I laid eyes on you. I just didn't put my finger on it until now. Did I not Is have power armor? else before we get going? Um. Where do you get this serum from? My father, Lorenzo Cabot, is confined in Parsons. He became dangerously unstable after handling an artifact he found on an archaeological dig in Arabia. He gained various seemingly paranormal powers, as well as becoming increasingly irrational and violent. In the end, I had no choice but to confine him, for his own safety, as well as ours. Jack, are you sure it's wise telling him all this? In the course of my attempts to cure him, I discovered that the artifact had introduced uh, anomalies into his blood. So the source of his insanity is also the basis of the treatments that have prolonged all our lives. The irony isn't lost on me, but if he were to escape from Parsons, I would lose my father forever. I will not allow that to happen. You mean you'd lose your fountain of youth has forever? made him paranoid, homicidally violent, and endowed with extraordinary abilities. Exactly what abilities are we talking about? Being locked up for 200 years by his own son might make anyone a bit grumpy. Exactly what abilities does he have? Uh, enhanced strength, unusual resistance to most kinds of physical damage. Oh, and a kind of local telekinesis, which appears to be projected by the artifact itself. That's why I've built a dampening field into his cell. Which is why we really need to stop these intruders before they turn it off. Before we go, I need you to understand something. When we get to Parsons, you need to do exactly what I tell you. Nothing more, nothing less. Is that clear? Why? Why is that so important? If these intruders have gotten past Edward's men, they may have freed Lorenzo. I'm the only one who understands exactly how to deal with him. Is that clear enough for you? Not really, no. But, uh... Okay. Good. Make sure you have whatever you'll need for a serious battle. I'll wait for you outside. Jack, be careful. And try not to hurt him. I love Father at least as much as you do. But you know as well as I do that if he gets free, there will only be one option. Don't let it come to that, please. I'll do my best, Mother. And if Imogene finally comes home, for God's sake, don't let her leave again until I get back. Now I really do have to go. I don't need anything right now, thank you. 
But won't you guys... I mean, if, if Papa dies, don't you guys lose your fountain of youth and shrivel up and die? I mean, your sister looked a little... You know... Prunish. Okay, this is very, very weird, but we have got to get back to the Institute as fast as possible and... Ready? Let's go. Just to be clear, under no circumstances can we allow Lorenzo to be freed from Parsons. I would have lost my father forever. I refuse to let that happen after spending so long trying to cure him. Dude, are you seriously going to run there? I was gonna go... Meet Jack outside Parsons State Insane Asylum. Can I meet him outside or do I have to kind of protect him? I have a horrible feeling. <gasps> I have a horrible feeling that um, he's going to get himself killed if we do that. I've got a vertebrate. Would he come it's with the us? the artifact that's made Lorenzo so dangerous. I'm sure his psychosis would be cured if it could be removed. But so far, all my attempts have failed. It's fused too tightly with his nervous system. Okay, so it's... it's. See, maybe I should stay with him because he actually keeps giving me useful information. It's too tightly fused with him. So this artifact is actually part of his body, kind of? Where are you going to go now? Yeah, this is mine, dude. Okay. Huh. Oh, didn't know we could go through there. So you're just gonna run along in your lab coat with a laser pistol. I'm well aware of the apparent conflict of interest in my father being the source of the treatment that is prolonging my own life. But I assure you that if I had the chance, I would gladly give it all up to have my father back. Even for a short time. Well, that's nice to know. If I believe you. And that's a big if, dude. That is a big if, I have to say. Although, you know. He's running along here completely. Why are you doing this? You're supposed to be rich and pow- Who? Okay, who's she? If I find you, you're gonna regret it. No, if I find him first. And she's gonna regret that too. Oh god. Oh, got it. Draw the hood. Oh. No. Mm. Would you like? Where? Did you get it? Oh, maybe. All right. Report. Oh god, this was a Brotherhood patrol. We were supposed. Oh dear. Right. Um. I'm wondering if you'd prefer T60. Oh god, is that? That's Jack. I think. D okay. Tank, but Jack, get the flop out of there. I think there's something else. This is Chikarnik. Oh sh. Is he all right? Legendary enemy is you. Shaded. Okay. He seems. Oddly okay. Rust Devil. Oh, that must have hurt. Okay. Does he even need our help? He just had a car explode on him and another one land on him. With no power armor and he's fine. Honestly, I think he's a bionic man. It must be all these serums he's been taking. Uh, did you want T60 armor? Because because there's a load of it back. I've got tons. I don't actually have tons at all. Let's, let's, let's get at least one. Let's get at least one set of T60 for you and see what color we can make it. Hello, Carla. Why is everybody walking around here with no armor, very little weaponry, and looking calm as hell? Okay, we're back to country crossing and still no sign of him. My god, he moves quite quickly, doesn't he? 
I'm seeing that's a provisioner. See, the one downside to having sentry bots as provisioners is they do sort of, unfortunately, every now and again make me think, there he is, uh, make me think rust devils are coming. Okay, we found him again. We found him again. He really can move. Why am I? Oh, of course, I'm tired. Tired and thirsty. Do I have any... I don't actually have much in the way of nuka stuff now. I'd like to be caffeinated. Yes, I would. But I don't want to be radiated concurrently. Uh, sorry, I don't want to use my last... Well, I don't want to use the last uh, bottle of cola that deradiates me. Unirradiates me? Okay, that... Is that... That is a provisioner, because that's like half Protectron, half Sentry Bot. So very mine. Wait, is that Finch Farm? Okay, you're coming to all the places I was in. There's more power armor. Of course, I left a power armor frame here, didn't I? I forgot all about that. Okay. Why are we coming this way? Out of curiosity. This way. I think leads to uh, to Saga's Ironworks, which we're going to pass. We're going. That's dead. Why did you decide to miss that bit of road? I mean, to be honest with you, that's probably a good idea. I remember the first time I came down this bit of road, there was a particularly. Wait, is that my... That was my provision. It looked like he had his hands up. Yeah, he's got the body of a Protectron and the legs of a sentry bot. He looks very, very cool. I would like to have introduced you, but um, Jack had different ideas. Yeah, we're going to call in there, pick up a sword, and hopefully some guys... What? Oh, oh God, that's terrible. Oh, I miss shooting things with that. Where are you? Where are you? I can't see anything. Oh, there he is. He's moved again. Stop hiding behind bloody trees. It's a. Oh, God, what the? What is that? That's a master. Okay. What are you? Force? I'm sorry. Did I hit you? If you were trying to help us, I do apologize. You're not trying to help me. Oh my god. What the hell? What the hell's a forged? I thought it was a name at first. It's not a name. Hello? He's. I do not want to attack. And, oh I don't plan on taking out the ironworks yet. I'm bloody well going to do it if you don't. Stop throwing grenades and stuff. Where's Jack? He's coming with us. Jack, this is not the way to the Hoss Institute. Good, what's she? That's her. Who's this and why is he helping us? ML. Oh! It's one of my. It's one of my provisions. Oh god. Where the hell? Where are the enemies? Are they? Oh, I see him, 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 I see him. This is where I should be using this. Come on, yes, Maybe I need a scope for this, actually, now that I think about it. Actually, a scope would put... Okay. Alright, are we done? Are we done? To be honest with you... I used to love that lever action rifle, but now I kind of prefer... I actually prefer my uh, AK. Right, 
Sorgus Ironworks. We finally discovered it. Yet we're not actually here to do anything. We're passing by. Jack. Where's Jack? We're following Jack, who's really... There were some other people to look... You know what? He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Let's not leave behind all of this loot. What the hell was this? It was a flamer. So these guys, guys are called the... Are called the Forged, and they are basically raiders who like flamers. Is is that what we're oh god talking about? Fragmentation sting and la laser rifle. There was another super mutant over somewhere. Oh, you know what? Let's find Jack. Let's just go find Jack. We're Getting mixed up in all sorts of fights. Did did Jack have anything more to tell us? Other interesting things. Is he really just gonna travels? The slog. This is the slog. What the hell is the slog? The slog? Where the hell are we now? Jack. Okay, we we gotta come back. Past here as well. Jeez. You really do pick a terrible route. Do you know this is a settlement, isn't it? It really is. Okay. All right. Do you have anything else useful to say? No? You're really going to get swept. He's swimming, full body swimming. I'm peckish. He's... That serum must give you superpowers. He's just gone swimming through radioactive sewage, basically. I am peckish. I'm hungry. This man probably didn't even bring a bloody snack. Oh, and I'm the type of guy who will never settle down Where pretty girls are, well, you know I'm a wanderer